All right, Travis, I know a lot of your fans were disappointed to not see you in a car. I know you're disappointed to not be in a car. What is it like to be out here on the sidelines? Well, I mean, as like a, a team owner, it, it's I feel really proud of Bryce. I mean, the you know discount tire Dodge Dart Red Bull car is awesome. He's done a great job with it. I mean, coming from just coming off a championship, but you know, for me, obviously, it's horrible to not be racing. It's uh, really hard to sit on the sidelines, but uh, you know, really excited. GRC is really growing. I mean, to be here at SEMA is good. So uh, all in all, it's good, but uh, definitely looking forward to next year. And that's what this the shoulders kept popping out. Uh, just wasn't wasn't really safe to be out there, and it takes four months to heal. So I wanted to be 100% for next year, and really hope to get this program uh, uh, really taken off. Yeah, that had to have been a tough decision for you to miss this race. But what does that say about how serious you are about 2013 and about the, about NASCAR? Well, 2013 is uh, is where my priorities are, and definitely, uh, you know, looking forward to doing the entire uh, nationwide series. And and uh, you know, with with this team, I mean, it's it's doing so much better. And just to come up with a startup car and you know have a win in the first season, and then you know as well as Bryce did, he uh, really helped the technicians. And uh, I'm not a great tester. Uh, I love to drive the car, but uh, Bryce has actually been really helping. Uh, you know, and hopefully uh, he'll be in the car next year as well, and uh, it'll be a lot of fun. So the, the, you're about a month out of surgery. Give us an update. How are you feeling? How's rehab going? Uh, well, basically, my doctor said just don't do anything. Don't touch it. Don't move it. Don't do anything. Uh, he's like, we want that scar tissue to get in there. Uh, so yeah, it's just uh, you know my shoulder was popping out the front and popping out the back. So it was just impossible to tape. And uh, you know, really uh, disappointing when you're racing and it pops out and then uh, you know you run into a wall or another driver for no reason. So definitely excited to be uh, finally be healthy. Um, I thought I'd be healthy enough to drive cars, but as it turns out, uh, you know, just from the motocross pass. So. Uh, we're going to be good. We're going to be 100% for next year, and uh, really looking forward to, you know, hopefully uh, come back out. The GRC is uh, a lot of fun, and everyone from Dodge and Dart, and uh, it's been good. So, are we supposed to believe you've been listening to your doctor and not doing anything? To be perfectly honest, I have done a pretty good job. Now we're doing. You know, I've been watching my wife. Uh, you know, she's uh, keeping me entertained uh, with the Nitro Circus live tour and everything, going to Europe and just uh, watching her skate. So, um, it's frustrating not being out there, and it is such a hard decision to to go under the knife. You know, when you know there's events and there's races uh, still left, but I, I really want to be out there next year. I want to make a serious effort, and everyone's like, "Oh, we'll do this, do that." I'm like, you know what? I want to drive NASCAR, and I want to be, uh, I want to be a champion. So that's what we're gonna do. All right, and you got to see Lindsay also win a race, win a car race as well, right? Do you guys celebrate an anniversary this weekend? Uh, we did, but she's stuck in Maryland in the hurricane, and uh, I was out here with all my crew and my friends in Vegas. So I guess that's not a, I didn't score any brownie points there, but I think I got a good anniversary gift. So uh, I love you, Lindsay, and uh, hopefully uh, you'll forgive me for being in Vegas on our anniversary. So uh, good luck to Bryce, and uh, hopefully it's, uh, it all works out.